Robert Mills was born in Charleston, South Carolina in 1781. Referred to as America's first architect, he studied under James Hoban, Henry Latrobe, and Thomas Jefferson. He was the first architect for the federal government and creator of the Washington Monument in Washington, D.C. Mills started life with no capital. At that time, architecture was not an organized profession, but it was something that Mills thought was needed. Mills and designers in his time looked back on democratic Greece and Republican Rome as the origins of American political and moral philosophy. Mills' major theme, his major idea was permanence. So Mills made a reputation very quickly for fireproof construction. Mills had a difficult time finding work. There were only two periods in his career when he had stable employment. The first period was in 1819. He was hired by the state of South Carolina to help build the canals and courthouses and jails throughout the state. Then in 1830, Andrew Jackson is elected president and Mills went to Washington and very quickly found himself part of the Jackson administration. Mills was successful in giving a concrete form, that is an architectural form, to his and Jefferson and others' idea that public buildings should be an appropriate expression of public purpose. Mills built the first marble building in Washington. And today, Washington is a city of marble buildings.